is another game with the urgency to win at this point? Um, I mean, we just got to find a way to get a win. I wouldn't say anything to do with, like, you know, trying to balance anything right now because the pads don't matter right now. And the only thing that matters is the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. And we just need to find out and figure out a way to win this weekend on the road. Um, from a defensive standpoint, um, we have to be able to um, affect the quarterback. We got to assault the middle of the pocket, um, especially from the way they run their offense. You know, they run the ball, but they live in play action pass, and um, where they, they want to block it up. Um, you know, I know it's a lot of questions about oh, they haven't only been sacked this amount of time, but the quarterback he have a good awareness in the pocket. Um, he one of them guys that make guys miss. Um, he try to dip under you or whatever it may be. You know, when we get an opportunity, we just got to get him to the ground. Can't try to um, kill a guy like him because, like I said, he do have a um, great pocket awareness where he know where to move because he know where he want to go get the ball, especially down the field on the play action passes. So uh, coming from my standpoint, we got to be able to affect the quarterback, be able to affect the middle of the pocket, disrupt the middle of the pocket, and eventually just create some turnovers. Um, that's what it's going to come down to because, you know, we haven't created enough turnover. And, and I think eventually they're going to come for us. Um, we've been very close at it, been batting balls. Um, got, Nico had a couple of them, you know, the last couple of games. Uh, so them, them tip balls are going to eventually turn to turnovers. How much do you like playing against I mean, I'm, the way you shut them up, it, you know, uh, make some plays, being able to hit them. You know, Baker always been um, a talker. You know, he always been a, you know, um, a competitor guy. So we could expect them to stick around no matter if they down or not, or even they up. So, um, like I said, to shut guys up on the field, you gotta shut them down and um, eventually be able to hit the quarterback. And that's all plan. Whenever I'm on the field, you know, I want to try and make a play. So I mean. In terms of focus, I feel like it's been the same the whole time. You, you and Will were able to connect a couple times against Pittsburgh. Was there anything different that, that has happened in practice or anything like that to lead to that production? Um, no, I would, I would say maybe, you know, there are certain days uh, me and Will would stay after, get a couple extra reps in, just get on the same page. But, um, you know, Will's a talented quarterback, and, you know, he's able to throw a lot of great balls. During the year, he would stay after practice and, you know, work with some of the receivers. Did yeah. you guys ever, ever do that during the year before? You know, you uh, yeah, there's a couple times we'd get in and do that. Um, especially uh, they'd pull a lot of us, us younger guys just to yeah. keep going over the plays and get a few extra reps in. Just, you know. What's been the pulse of the locker room since he was being named the starter? It feels like there's a lot of energy around him. I mean, I, I feel like our, our locker room's been, been the same. Um, just we're all positive. We know he can play ball. Um, we know all three of those guys are really talented quarterbacks. So, um, Will's the starter. We're going to roll with him and um, go play some football. Will says uh, he, he's not really worried about winning approval from anybody, but, you know, how much does he establish himself as a leader in the short time that he's played? Uh, yeah, he definitely has. Just, you know, how he handles himself day in and day out and then um, achieving just going out there and the way he's been able to play, play the game and uh, have success. For you personally, it feels like since that Giants game in your debut, you've been waiting on <laughs> a pop like that and you've been waiting patiently. So how good did that feel? What does it do for your confidence moving forward? Yeah, no, it definitely felt good. But, I mean, at the end of the day, the only stat that really matters is uh, wins and losses. And, you know, we weren't able to get that win. So um, it's kind of really the only thing I was thinking about. What stands out about this uh, Tampa defense you're really facing on Tampa? Um, great defense front, good DBs, real physical. So, you know, just got to be good with releases, routes, all that, and just, just play hard. And how much you hope I could kind of thank you yeah, you know, it was nice to, to get back involved and contribute more to helping this team. Um, but, you know, like like I said, you know, I had a few catches, but the only stat that really matters is, you know, wins and losses. And uh, at the end of the day, we didn't win the game. So that's the biggest thing I was really thinking about after. From a health standpoint, you feel good. And I, I know that's probably a big part of it. Yeah, feel healthy. Um, just ready to go. Uh, I guess Will, after the game, said maybe one of those plays you got maybe you fall through in three games. Uh, what's it like getting on the same page with another quarterback? And how do you think he's done so far? Uh, you know, I feel like it happened pretty naturally, pretty fast. You know, I'm just all the days throughout camp, just working with him, catching balls. Um, happened pretty fast. I mean, it wasn't really any hiccups. He's a really talented quarterback, and uh, it's pretty easy. How do you guys support him as he comes in here? What are we? What maybe impresses the most about him? So how do we support him? Right. Uh, just give him a clear picture, you know, be real decisive in all their, our decisions and um, try and make his e reads as easy as possible. What's the challenge uh, Sunday in Tampa? 
weather's gonna be a little, a little yeah. different out there. It's gonna be warm, but uh, I don't think it'll be too much of a challenge, but it'll definitely be something different.